All right, and inverse functions, inverse functions are considered one-to-one -one as long as, well, let's go back. Okay? In, in 980, a function is anything that has, if you have an x value, that's your input, it needs to spit out only one y value or output. A one-to-one -one function means that every y value output has only one input. So before, and by the way, <clears throat> The answers for these are strictly vocabulary. It's like yes or no. Is it one-to-one -one or is it not one-to-one? Uh, one so before, in 980, we have this problem. And the first question right here we can see, is this a function? Well, this is a function because every input, which is here on the left, this is our input, that's the age, has an, a very specific output, right? If you're five, you play t-ball. If you're six, you play t-ball, right? If you're five, you don't play t-ball or minor league. See the difference there? So that's what makes it a function. Every one of these inputs has only one arrow coming out of it, which indicates that it has one output. On the other hand, though, for it to be, so it is, yes, a function, but for it to be a one-to-one -one function, it means that every one of the outputs has to have one input. So see how we've got two arrows coming out of the t-ball going the other direction? That would make it not one-to-one. -one. I guess I maybe should use a colon there, one-to-one. -one. <clears throat> now this is for mapping, okay? We're going to be looking at, I think we've got some equations, but... Really, we're very concerned with the graphs on these because, well, we're going to be doing some graphing. All right, like this one. First, let's see if it's a function. So that means that every input, which is here on the left, we've got our input, and on the right, we've got our output. Everything from the input has to have one arrow coming out of it, which we do. Now, again, we, for a function, we don't care if they're pointing to the same thing. We just need one arrow coming out of each one of them. So yes, this is a function, but is it one-to-one? -one? So now we've got to work backwards. So the arrows are now pointing to the left. And each of these only have one arrow coming out of them to the left, which means that, yes, this is a one-to-one -one function. Okay, And that's what that slide in the beginning was telling us.